Are we on? It looks like it. Hi, everybody. Get up there. Here we go. Greetings and salutations, one of all. It is the last catacombs of April 2022. Can you believe it? We're done with April, everybody. Hi, I'm your friendly neighborhood Julian the Hooligan, and welcome to the catacombs here on the Sworn Nation. Let me see how my camera angle. Hey, that looks pretty good. Wow, I did that really sharp. Yay! Anyways, we got a lot of great stuff for you. I got a lot of cool stuff for you on the catacombs, but we've got, uh, well, something special happening next week that I, I, I will bring to your guys' attention right after I'm done with the news. <laughs> We would like to start things off here on the Sworn Nation to celebrate Sworn Club member Spotlight, Mark Bird. He has said, quote, there's plenty of ways to know you're a Sworn, but none better than when your partner surprises you with a great, uh, a great gift straight from the Coffin Comics that you had no idea about. Not only did my partner nail the perfect gift, but also made her choice as she knows I love homages and Tony Flex pony death art. Great to tide me over while it's away from my wargasm Kickstarter notification. Swarm, Mark, thank you very much for joining us. I doubt you guys can see this lovely picture of Mark. Uh, if Jimmy can, he'll pop it up on the link. Eric Hart, how the heck are you? You beautiful man, you. You are so beautiful. Jimmy, how are you? All right, so guys, it's only $25 to join the Sworn Club. If you haven't, you should. You could be a member of Spotlight on our weekly newsletter. Spotlight you and your, uh, your collection or one of your uh, favorite uh, Coffin Comics collectibles. And uh, say a little quote. We'll go ahead and put you on Sworn Nation and celebrate you in our newsletter. Here's some of the perks you get for that $25 annual uh, membership fee. Special access to Coffee Comics Insider News before anyone else. You'll be in the know before the VIP knows. So this makes you a Swarm Club member. You are like the elite of the elite. You know information before anyone else. Early access to Coffin Comics shop promotions. Like what I'm about to show you. Sworn Club members, you get to shop an hour before the general public whenever we launch a new promo. Usually on Fridays, we launch promos um, around 9 a.m. From 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. Arizona time, look it up on your time zone. Um, for that first hour, we launch those promos. Sworn Club members get to dip in and pick up uh, before the general public. An hour later, we open it up to the general public, and it's a total free-for-all. So that's another perk. Here's another one. Invite only special online events and announcements. Um, you also get special access to Coffee Comics Sworn Club member only comics and merchandise. Yes, take advantage of that. You get a one time 10% discount on certain items offered on Coffee Comics Cop 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 Shop, and you're automatically entered into a monthly prize drawing uh, where you get a beautiful Coffee Comics bag. We throw you some comics, throw stickers, some mini cards, whatever. We throw in some fun stuff for you. And then if once a month we go ahead and bring out the big box of all the Sworn Club members, we randomly pick that member's name and we will ship that wonderful bag off to you. Now it's really great, $25 in annual fees, a really great fee, and you get so many awesome perks. Now, I'm going to show you some examples that will be going live on Wednesday, this coming Wednesday, May 4th. It's our annual May the 4th Be With You promo. <laughs> Woo! I absolutely love these. I look forward to these editions when we offer them each year. And I am very, very excited uh, because they've definitely mixed it up and I love what we've done this year. Let me see if there's any comments. Ace Bonnie, thank you for joining me today. Miguel, you'll have past Brady. <laughs> uh, those new far, uh, farm girl Aryans are proof enough, it says. The... Yeah, Eric Hart, you, you, bravo. I couldn't have said it better myself. 
those Farm Girl editions he's talking about flew out of the store. So yes, it is a very good perk to be a Sworn Club member. So you can get that one hour early access before the general public and get those editions you want before they sell out. So don't snooze or else you could lose because these editions always go really quick, just like uh, Eric Hart said. So Eric beautifully said, thank you again. Uh, Ace Bonnie, I am doing great. There's nothing up on me. Ha ha ha! Dirty dad joke. That's for uh, Brandy right there. Okay, so what we got going live on Wednesday, May the 4th is our annual May the 4th exclusives. So let's start things off with one of our presentations. And these go live Monday, or excuse me, Wednesday, May the 4th. This is Lady Death, Merciless Onslaught, Darth Death Edition. This is... Um, David Harrigan is, oh, excuse me, Monty Moore is the artist. It's $25. It will be limited to 150 serial number copies. Limit two copies per customer, per household, $25 for this beautiful Monty Moore Dark Death Edition that goes live May 4th, 9 a.m. for all you Sword Club members. General public, an hour after that, we will open the stores to you. And this is a really beautiful edition. I'm really excited about this. This is Lady Death. Apocalyp Apocalyptic Abyss number one. This is the Boba Death edition. David Harrigan is doing it right, and he's continuing on this year of great covers. This will run you $25. Uh, 125 serial number copies, limit two per customer. Her household. Let me go ahead and move that a little closer so you guys can just see the beauty of this art. I mean, look at that. Oh, Dane Ellington, Ellingson, how are you, man? Beautiful. This goes live May the 4th. Early dip-ins for Sworn Club members. And you get this beautiful edition. This is just the mock-up, but this, will, this edition will go live. If you're someone club member, scoop them up. Because remember those Farmer Daughters editions, they went real quick. All right. And what would a Harrigan edition be without carrying on with the Naughty edition? This is Lady Death Apocalyptic Abyss. Naughty Boba Death Edition. This will run you $30. It consists of 150 serial number copies, limited to copies per customer per household. Thank you, Jimmy, for the technical assist. I love it when you come in. We gotta see these up the close. Yeah. yeah. These are beautiful, guys. Whoop, wait, 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 boy, cowboy. So <laughs> this is, again is Lady Death, Apocalyptic Abyss, Naughty Boba Death Edition, David Harrigan, sending it off into that stratosphere, into a galaxy far, far away, and they'll be available on Wednesday, so you can scoop them up. May the force be with you, but, We've got another really beautiful one. Get ready, uh, Gomez fans. Um, I've been really hoping for something like this, and here it is. This is La Muerta Vengeance number one. La Man uh, Muerta Lorian edition. Oh, hell yes. Yeah. Scott, how are you, man? Robert Bradford, thank you for joining me today. Love you guys all. Thank you very much. Um, I am doing really good, Robert. Thank you for asking. So this is it. La Muerta Vengeance number one. La Muerta Lorian edition. I can't believe I pronounced that <laughs> right. This is going to be limited to 100 serial numbered copies. $25 the price. Joe Gomez is the artist along with Dan Feldmeyer doing the graphics. And Casio Andrade, Andrade doing the color on this cover. Uh, there's only a limit of one per customer, per household. I am so glad we made a La Muerta homage edition for our May the 4th uh, offerings. I am so excited. I, I was hoping we would do this and it's finally here. So La Muerta fans, applaud. This thing is gonna go quick. And Joe Gomez, beautiful, beautiful job. I love that instead of the Grogu or Baby Yoda, some people know him, <laughs> he, he got Loco sitting there in the pouch. This is a beautiful homage edition. I can't wait to see you people eat it up on Wednesday. All right, Hellwitch fans, we didn't forget you at all. Don't worry, we, we got a new Hellwitch 
May the 4th edition for you. How about feasting your eyes on Hell Witch the Forsaken? This is Hell Wars edition. This will run you $25. Cover art by Ali Garza and Chuck Michael Obosh is doing the covers. I hope I pronounced that right. $25. 125 serial numbered copies. Limit two per customer per household. Ali Garza fan. Star Wars fans. This is for you. This is a really great edition. I'm glad Ellie Garza is contributing to our May the 4th edition. So again, these editions go live May the 4th. And I also have a special Wednesday show for you guys next week to celebrate May the 4th. So let's continue on to the greatness that is Hell Witch the Forsaken Risqué Hell Wars edition. This will run you $30. There's 150 serial numbered copies. Limit two customers per household, or two copies per customer per household. I keep mixing my words up. Anyways, again, Ali Garza is the pencilist. Chuck Michael Olak is the colorist. This is stunning, absolutely beautiful. And you know what? This year we've been really introducing uh, some of our characters and cover editions. We are continuing that this year, uh, this week, uh, or I should say this coming promotion. Excuse me. This is Lady Death, Sacrificial Annihilation, Insurrectus Rookie Card Edition. This will run you at $25, 100 serial number copies, limit one copy per customer, per household. Diego Bernard, again, contrib contributing to these beautiful rookie card editions. I believe this is our third one we have offered so far this year. Uh, Lady Satanus was prior along with Lady Death. Now we have Insurrectus. These go live on Wednesday, May 4th. And what would a rookie card be without the metallic card? Yes, there will be. A metallic card edition limited to 250 co co uh, copies. There is a limit of five per customer, per household. There's 250 of these beautiful rookie card metallic. This is a metal card, ladies and gentlemen. And this will go live Wednesday, May 4th. Keep it on that train. And we are proud to also present... Th this is beautiful. Um, Elias Chatsudas. All you fans out there are going to go wild. We did this last year. How about taking it up a notch this year? This is Lady Death Lingerie Smile Metallic Edition. This will be limited to 77 serial numbered copies. It will run you $100. It's a limit of one copy per customer per household. And you know it's the heat is turned up because Elias Chatsudas absolutely captures your imagination with this cover. Absolutely beautiful. Again, only 77 serial number copies. Limit one copy per customer per household. $100 is the going price. Now, along with like all our other promos, we also have 11 by 17 prints. These will also go live on Wednesday, May 4th. And then we will close the offering on these prints on Monday, I believe it's May the 9th. So these editions will be available for about five days, Wednesday through Monday. Usually we take everything down so we can get the prints printed up. So if you are a print collector, you may wanna make your decisions on the 11 by 17 prints. They'll run you $16 each, or we also have a really beautiful bundles. So this right here is the uh, Hell Wars. Again, Ali Garza is the artist, Hell Witch is the character. This is the nice version. $16 goes live on Wednesday, May 4th. All right, let me get my fingers in position because Ali Garza's made it hard for me. I gotta really stretch for this one. This is the Risqué Hell Wars edition. Uh, this will run you $16, and it would only be available from Wednesday, May 4th, all the way up to Monday. I believe it's May 9th or 10th. Jimmy, if you could pop that up and uh, let the beautiful folks know, make sure I'm giving them the correct information. And. This is beautiful. I, I love this. I really love this image. This is the uh, 11 by 17, uh, 11 17 print of La Muertalorian edition. Uh, this is an 11 17 by print. I absolutely love this. I'm so excited that we're doing it. Thank you, Joel Gomez, for 
doing a really beautiful homage to The Mandalorian. I love the show, and I absolutely love this cover. $16, 11 by 17 print, available on Wednesday. Also, here's the Monty Moore, um, <coughs> where did I call her? Uh, Darth Death Edition. This is an 11 by 17 print, $16. And these are only available from that Wednesday, uh, Wednesday through Monday is the only times these will be available. All right, and let's continue it with David Harrigan's uh, Boba Death Edition. This is an 1117 print. This also will go live for $16, Wednesday, May 4th through that Monday. Also, here is the, woo, hey, look out, I forgot to put my fingers in place. This is the Naughty Boba Death Edition by Harrigan. This is an 11 by 17 print. It goes live Wednesday through Monday. And of course, here is the rookie card. This is the 11 by 17 Insurrectus. This is again, it's $16. Will go available Wednesday, May 4th through Monday. And of course, the Elias Chatzua, this print is offered again. This is Elias Chatzua's uh, Smile Edition. I believe it was. I'm having a brain fart. Anyway, $16. Now, we also have a print set. That's right, you can get all of these prints. It is a total of eight prints for $100. Eight prints for $100 goes live, and it's called the Coffin Comics, May the 4th, 2022, 11 by 17, print set. Woo, spittle, sorry. <laughs> Anyways, guys, that is what we will be presenting to you Wednesday, May 4th. Also, uh, great news. Brandy is proud to announce, along with the uh, Warehouse Crew, Hell Witch vs. Lady Death War Gaze and Kickstarter update. It has shipped and out the building! We have got everything shipped out. I'm knocking things over because I'm so excited. They are headed your way. Thank you, everybody who's been posting those really beautiful photos. I'd like to see some more unboxing videos. I really love everyone's faces when they just find that treasure for the first time that they didn't know where to get because we just tip stuff in, into your physical rewards when you get them. So, lots of excitement. Uh, since the March of YouTube premium will be Friday, do we get the PDF reload? Of course, Jessica, uh, expect that PDF to get shipped out. Um, Brian, um, and we always ship that out so you guys can definitely do your little uh, pre-choices uh, and whatnot. So don't worry, we'll get that PDF out to you. Um, I know that's uh, something you guys really look forward to every Kickstarter, so that's something we try to uh, keep going with it. You're welcome, Jessica, but you know what's better? You're awesome. I'm not awesome. You're awesome. So let's be awesome together, everybody. All right. Lady Death Necrotic Genesis. The bonus items are arriving. Everything is getting assembled, and we are so happy to get this stuff in and then out to you. Speaking of the Necrotic uh, Genesis Kickstarter, the Last Chance pop-up crypt is open from um, today and will close on May 6th at 5 p.m. Arizona time, which is 5 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time, 7 p.m. Central Daylight Time, and 8 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. That is right. The Necrotic Genesis pop-up crypt is open now until May 6th. So, you missed out on something you didn't think you could get on the Kickstarter, you might want to get it now? Well, now's the time. Jump in, get it, get all those beautiful things that maybe passed you by and now you have a little extra scratch. Go ahead and grab that stuff in our pop-up crit. It's only up, uh, again, up temporarily until May 6th. And speaking of Kickstarters, we are proud to announce in two weeks the launch of La Muerta Prime Evil. Kickstarter event. I am so excited. I can't wait to be here. I can't wait to see if we're going to have any special guests. I can't wait to see the shenanigans. I can't wait to see the posts from all you beautiful people sharing the links, commenting on what you're looking forward to, because that is my favorite part. We go live to show you all the fun. We go live to show you all the beautiful additions. And Brian is a hell of a showman, and everyone has a lot of fun. So don't delay. Join us in two weeks, and that'll be May 11th here at HQ on all your streaming services. Okay, YouTube, Facebook, you know where to go to watch that show. And not only that, share the wealth. We've got some really beautiful editions coming out. Uh, this right here is the Jewel Edition by Sun K. Bam, that is one of the editions we are offering on May 11th at the launch of our Kickstarter. 
That's right, La Muerta, chapter 8. Here's another uh, beautiful one, Jose Varis. This is the Jungle Witch edition. This, again, will launch Monday, or excuse me, Wednesday, May 11th, 2022. Join the fun, because this Kickstarter is great, man. It's going to be a lot of fun. Share it. You think people are going to enjoy the type of stuff we do? Send them our way. That's what we're here to do. I'm going to take a quick swig of my water. Mm. Ah, uh, just wondering the opening next. I've got an itch and the vault will scratch it. Well, they, I don't know. Um, but speaking of vault, I have started reaching out to people, sending out emails uh, starting yesterday, uh, letting folks know I found stuff on their want list. So keep an eye out on your emails from this lovely person, Julian at CompTonComics.com. I will be sending you an email letting you know what I have found and um, if you are still interested. Upon that, please let me know. Um, I've already got uh, three wonderful people hooked up with stuff they were looking for, so please reply back as quickly as possible. I don't want to hate because some of these uh, things, um, multiple people want certain editions, so it's going to be the first person to answer and um, want me to invoice them, we'll get those. If there is going to be like over a week delay to hear back from you, I'm going on to the next. So just to let you folks know that it's going to be want this. Um. <laughs> sure thing, Eric. Um, I'll reach out to you. Uh, Ace Bounty, uh, we need a Hell Witch coin and a Lamorta coin. Dude, that'd be cool. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, what if we don't have email uh, access until after work? Um, you can get it after work or at home. I don't know. Um, how do you normally do it? I, I, I know we send it out, but, um, I don't know. Uh, I know I get it. What if we don't have, oh God, you don't have email. How is it? Get it on your phone and then you can look at the PDF on your phone or a tablet too. If you are unable to, um, uh, head home, um, I, I would recommend definitely the PDF. Oh my God, really? Jessica Hartman, wow, that's that's a strict job. Um, sell body parts or government secrets? Anyways, uh, that's it for the news. Let's get on to some beautiful books and items we have for you here at the Catacombs. So I'm gonna start things off. I got some packs here for y'all. Evil Ernie, this is Glow in the Dark, Series 2 Chromium Glow in the Dark cards. I've got about 20 packs online right now. I put a limited two so everyone has a chance to scoop up these packs before they sell out and someone does not actually uh, hog them all. I wanna make sure everyone gets these. So that's right, unopened packs all the way from the year 1995. We're taking it way back, way back today. Check it out. I, I miss card boxes like this. You prop it up, you got the nice little 3D promo to show off the art, you got card packs in there. Ah, some days I miss slinging books at a shop. All right, let's get things started. I got something really rare here for you. I found it on accident. I even had to check my pocket to make sure it wasn't mine. So, without further ado, I have Lady Death, the Apocalyptic Abyss Challenge Coin. Only one, only one is available. I can't believe I found one of these. Um, the last time I had one of these available, and again, it was only one, I believe it was... Uh, early late last year so it's been a while uh just having to open a box going through some stuff and bam there was that challenge one so that is the very last one that is a catacombs five all right i also have folks for you who've been liking the 11 7 uh, 11 by 6 prints uh i now have found a few more and a lot of these these are the last of them uh, after these sell uh, we are sold out, but this is the Lady Death Aftermath by David Michael Beck. These are the last mini prints I have that I'm offering you today here at the Catacombs. What else do we got? Thank you, Jimmy. Putting up those links. I always appreciate you. All right, and also, these are also the last of the 4 by 6 prints of the Sacred Heart by Richard Ortiz. Last 4 by 6 prints available right now. These are the last. Once they are gone, that is it. I do not have any more of these editions. I do possibly may have found a box with some other ones. So um, stay tuned for those if you've been liking four by six prints. Also, I still have to present to you today from 
Mr. Scott Lewis, this is All Souls. This is a four by six mini print available now. Wow, that was quick. Yeah, whoever got that challenge coin, congratulations. Um, you got a piece of history right there. That's an actual beautiful, 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 beautiful items. All right, here we go. These go way back also. This is, I think, to help promote the opening of Chaos Comics. This is a hollow foil card for Chaos Comics coming in May, and Brian has signed my last two I have. There is the COA that will come with the card. Uh, these are really old promo cards from the early 90s, so taking it back, these are the last two I have for you. I also have the uh, last two of, this is Evil Ernie Chromium card number five, and again, signed by Brian. There's the COA. I only have two left of these. Once these are gone, that's it. Uh, it is getting really scarce for me to find any of the classic Chaos Era items, but once I find them, I'll bring them to you. All right, and then these are the last ones I have for the Evil Ernie promo card number one. Bam, Brian has signed these and even put a beautiful quote uh, right there on a couple and say, die! So, classic Brian Polito. I absolutely love it, but again, these are my last five. Once they are gone, that is it. No more. Also, for all you Stretch and Dent fans, I am proud to say I have, right now, seven Scratch and Dent Masterpiece editions. These are only fifty dollars. It's a great value. Still, lots of beautiful art in these editions. Uh, this got a little scratch and dent, so the value gets moved on to you. Normally, these retail for eighty dollars, fifty dollars. Right now, these are only ones I have available for the masterpieces. So once they're sold out, that's it. Also, this is the last one I present to you of the Muerta Vengeance Chase Edition. Last one, one and done. That is a warehouse find. Also, another one, La Muerta. This is the last copy of Retribution Fire Power Edition. That is it. We are officially sold out once that copy goes. Also, continuing the tradition of the Scratch and Dents, I got a Nightmare Symphony Seraphim Edition. This is also uh, signed by Brian. Uh, it does have the COA, and it is Scratch and Dent. So that's here for you guys today. Let's see if anyone else... Wow, yeah, Robert, that's crazy, beautiful. All right, and this cover was oh so nice. Brian had to sign it twice. This is Lady Death Killers, Lady Web Edition. Boom, and just for funs and giggles, I'm gonna put two COAs since he signed it twice. Oh, that's right. Sometimes Brian looks at the art, he's captivated. He is blinded by its beauty. He sometimes signs them twice. It happens, not that often, but it does. All right. I also have another side scratch and dent. This is Naughty Pumpkin Queen Edition. Bam, one scratch and dent available to you today. All right. Also, these are the last three. These are all signed by Brian Polito. Not only is the comic signed, but so is the metal card that comes with it. This is the La Muerta um, homage collection. This is the homage of the first appearance of Punisher in Spider-Man 129, if I'm not mistaken. So the last three today. And I'm very happy to present, this is really old school. This is a mock-up of Lady Death the Reckoning Metallic Edition. This is a test-proof mock-up. Bam, it has a remark by Marat Michaels and signed by Brian Polito. Only one we have, this is the very first mock-up we ever did when we first started off the Metallic Edition. Well, let's see. I have a feeling it, it might just be the an actual, yeah, there is actual page content. So it is the reckoning number one. So there is page content. Boom, and not only that, I love this. This is, you know, all the cool little graphics as we evolved over the years, so bam. Get it today, I only got one, hey, hey, hey. Yeah, wow is right, wow is right. That was it, this was actually something I offered way back on the very first Catacombs I did over two years ago. So that was uh, taking it way back and uh, had ran into Marat and asked for a nice little uh, remark and he said, sure. So it is available today, that's everything I got for you guys today. Does anyone have any questions or wanna say anything? Oh my God, it's already time for lunch. All right guys, that's gonna wrap it up for me today. 
Uh, please keep an eye out on your emails. I am sending out emails letting folks know I found items in their, uh, from their want list. So keep an eye out from that uh, email from me letting you know what I found for you. Everybody, I hope you have a wonderful weekend. A beautiful weekend. This week is almost done, and we also got some other great stuff coming up for you guys. I'm Julian Hooligan. I'm sworn to you. Thank you, everyone, for joining me today. I will see you guys on Monday on our YouTube channel, the CCSN. I am out. You all are beautiful.